The following contest is a steel cage match. This match can be won by pinfall, submission, or escaping the cage. And it is for the WWE Championship. Introducing the challenger from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, weighing in at 234 pounds, Brett Hitman Hart. And here's your old nemesis, Brett the Hitman Hart. Well, you know, we may not have always gotten along, but he is the best there is, the best there was, and the best there ever will be. Whoa, it looks like he hasn't missed many gym sessions. And his opponent, weighing in at 275 pounds, Ultimate Warrior. The famous sprint to the ring by the Warrior. And the crowd is just lapping it up, Cole. They love the Ultimate Warrior. Big match for him here tonight. This is it, the moment we've been waiting for. The time for talking is behind us. Now these two superstars will test one another's abilities and will like never before. This is about being the best. Has the chin lock. And the tie up, make no mistake about it. This is all about skill, determination, and power. And we're watching human gridlock here. No one will budge. And uh, looking at Ultimate Warrior, what's the story for him right now? Definitely looking focused here tonight, but would you expect anything less with a vacant title up for grabs? Look at this. He's in full control of this one. Bret Hart reversing it. Incredible. And now Bret Hart pushing forward. In all my years, Kang, I don't think I've ever seen a superstar systematically dismantle his opponents the way Bret Hart does. Yeah, he's unbelievable, Cole. I can tell you from experience. You know, the whole excellence of execution thing isn't just some catchy nickname. It's the truth with the hitman. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. Bret Hart with a nice reversal. Standing may not be an option after that. Another Bret Hart characteristic that I don't think any superstar can match is the level of pride he takes in his game. I'm not so sure there's another man on earth that wants to be the best more than Bret Hart. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Today, too fast. Oh! Putting it all on the line. That's the way. Look at this big time. It was incredible. Yep, that's the reversal by Bret Hart. Well, you talked a little bit about Bret Hart's pride earlier, but you know what else is amazing? is the level of pride his fans have. Everywhere I go, there's a kid wearing Hitman sunglasses or one of his T-shirts. And that escape attempt cost him. I love these cage matches. Why would you love a cage match, Cole? They're brutal. And the Warrior with the reversal. This might be big.
My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Cole, if you ask me, Bret Hart's sharpshooter is right up there with Ric Flair's figure four, or even Stone Cold Stunner, and all the other iconic finishers from over the years. Man, Ultimate Warrior, what offense! Look out! Oh, I think this man needs business. Somebody's gonna get hurt in this match. What a slam. Oh. This entire building just moved. Man, you're right, that shook the arena. It is so hard to stop that kind of strength. He's making a statement here with this attack. Bret Hart sharpshooter certainly is iconic. And what makes it even more impressive is that he can put it on literally anybody. Even incredible move by Ultimate Warrior. We know what this is. Perhaps Ultimate Warrior has this match won now, people. One, two. Adding insult to potential injury there. And a great shot by Ultimate Warrior. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. This is where you need to look out. The wall of a WWE steel cage measures 15 feet high. And that's dangerous no matter who you are. Well, you can say that again, Michael. That'll definitely give you a different perspective on the severity of a steel cage match. And the hands are on the very top of the cage. Is this enough to be victorious? Are we seeing the end of this match? Oh, no! Look at this! At the very top of the cage! You know, when I think of the Ultimate Warrior, there's one thing I think of more than anything else. His immeasurable power. Combine that with his kinetic energy. Amazing what a maneuver by Bret Hart. Will it be? And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. The Ultimate Warrior is not done yet. Watch out. That was power on top of more power. What a slam. That was a perfectly executed slam. This is where you need pulled back in. Look at the eyes. Ultimate Warrior is imposing his will quite well right now. He thinks he has it. One, two. The strike finds its target. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Few superstars. Great counter. Looking highly motivated here. This is where you need to look out. The wall of a WWE steel cage measures 15 feet high. And that's dangerous no matter who you are. Well, you can say that again. Whoa! Climbing out might not have been such a good idea. Wait, what the? Oh, hold on, now where is he going? Oh man, you hope when you see someone climb up there that they at least have a plan. And he's going up the cage. My God, he's nipping right at his... Oh boy, that's one way to keep him in the cage. Wait, what the? Oh, hold on, now where is he going? Oh man, you hope when you see someone climb up there that they at least have a plan. He's nearing the floor, yes. and his opponent can just look on. King Irving. What a tremendous victory. And here's some highlights from the matchup. And here's just some of the action we saw during the match. Oh, what a spectacular match. Look at this! This was a match that was simply mesmerizing. Here's your winner and the new WWE Champion, Ultimate.
Ultimate Warrior. A well-earned victory indeed. This guy impressed the hell out of me tonight, Michael. What a victory. Wow. Just wow. I'm speechless. What an amazing match.